What up everyone, Kickin' Tiger here. Super excited, Season 6 of Fall Guys just released. Looks like the Fame Pass went into the live servers just a few minutes ago. So I'm just going to go through and kind of walk through the Fame Pass, check out some of the new different UI elements, and give my reactions and thoughts. So definitely stick around and let's go. Here is our new intro screen, Season 6. You can see the different color changes. Looks pretty good. I like the new logo. So let's go ahead and jump in and see what else we got. All right, looks like we got a little bit in our news feed here. The season six fame path is here. Play now and earn a parade of limited time rewards, including two exclusive Jin Sakai costumes. Collect both and experience Jin's full journey to become the ghost and reclaim his clan's honor. What else we got? Season 6 party on now. It's season 6. Kick off the party with a show filled with all our brand new rounds running right now. Stay tuned for the exciting Sackboy event launching tomorrow. Sackboy Challenge Live 1st through 5th of December. Very exciting stuff right there. I do not know who Jin Sakai is, but I will have to figure that out. Looks like a cool outfit nonetheless. Let's go ahead and jump into the Fame Pass and see what we got. I haven't been looking at the spoilers. I wanted to keep it a little fresh so we can go through. I'm actually going to change my outfit real quick. Let's just take off the upper and the lower just so we can see the colors better as we're going through. And we'll also switch to something mm, that uses both colors pretty well. Let's go with this. This has got both colors. Now we're ready to check it out. Carnifaller. That's a cool look. I, I like the feathers. I definitely think that's going to be a very popular costume. Bacon and eggs. Yeah, I see it. Party starter. I could I could rock with that. Bottom of the carnivaler. That's cool. I think that will go good with a bunch of different costumes that currently exist. Beach ball buff. I've been looking for a new one of those. There's a Jin Sakai right here. Samurai bottom. Eh, I don't know how I feel about that. Party flags, that's pretty chill. You'll definitely see me rocking that one. Ooh, Diver. That is a good nameplate. That may be my new nameplate once I get it unlocked. Jin Sakai top. It's cool. It's not a whole lot to it, but it's got a decent look. Parakeet. Now that's a color I can uh, mess with there. I definitely enjoy the brighter colors. It's a good look. Chill vibes. Okay, I'll have to see what the top looks like. Definitely got the hippie lower element to it. Definitely seems like something you could wear with a lot of different outfits. Peach fuzz. Very similar to the faceplate I have on, actually. But cool nonetheless. Chill vibes. Now we're talking... This is my kind of look right here. Rainbow sunglasses, some chill wings. More nameplates. I feel like there's a lot of nameplates this time around. Mr. Sealson. Okay, what is the next part of this going to be? Because I... <laughs> I think we're going to end up lots of people with random costumes with tails coming out the bottom. 80s party. Pretty fun. Mr. Sealson. Look at this. This may take the record for tallest costume in the game. It's getting cut off off the top already. Follow Palooza. I'm going to be shouting this one out a bunch in the stream, I'm sure. AKA Follow Palooza. Lady Margot. Very nice. Eggshell. Oh, that's a good subtle color. Leopard print. Why couldn't it have been tiger? Why is the tiger locked behind a million crowns? Very sad times. Maybe I should have been kicking leopard instead of kicking tiger. Up next, we got Lady Margot, the top. Very fancy. Call her the aristocrat. Got a good nickname there already. Just wow. I feel like I have a very similar color palette to this already. Maybe it's flipped. The Big Yetus. This is the one I've been waiting for. Gotta love any costume where the bottom is just shoes. Can wear it with anything. Very versatile outfit. Crown Tally. 
that's cool kind of makes me think like you're in prison right on the wall i'll be slime another good nameplate this might end up being the nameplate season and here it is the big yeetus super stoked about this skin i did see it in a leak and this is definitely going to be <laughs> i ventured the most popular skin from this season we will see very nice everyone loves the yeetus or the yeetai pipe dreamer Ooh. now that i like this color a lot here you can see the subtle purple huh yeah i'm gonna night owl dark faceplate bright eyes I have a few of those already very cool the ghost now see this is what i'm thinking when i see a samurai other than the sword phasing through the arms there pretty good look Ooh, crown town now that is a very slick clean especially now that i'm the fleet admiral feels like something you would have emblem on your uh uniform well that is something right there <laughs> that emote is going to be playing in your ear for at least three months so get used to it very creative and the ghost pretty cool not my favorite end of season skin but it's definitely a good looking one i probably prefer mm, season five's final skin more but still a cool looking skin let's check around let's see if there's anything else to really see here not a whole lot right now you know you got the challenges of course um i am curious let's check out the shows we got main show, full squads, duos, and Fall Guys Fiesta. So Fall Guys Fiesta looks like it's going to be just season six levels. That's cool. And I'm also going to check and see if the custom shows have anything new or if. Okay, so we got Fall Guys Fiesta in the custom games. That's at least good news. I'm going to go ahead and favorite that. So if you join my custom game, we're definitely going to be playing this one a lot today um so get used to it anything else change doesn't look like it everything else seems to be the same so far which is fine with me well that's season six i uh, can't wait to get in and play some of the levels and look forward to doing that this evening so very exciting stuff let's go season six build the hype